when you think that you're in a perfect and idyllic situation and something changes and you're not prepared for it you know the beauty of boat life is you simply move along I've said it before move along home mood hoovers you know the type you've seen them you've experienced them you know what it's just not worth it is it don't stay there don't dwell on it don't let it affect you yeah just imagine living rent free in somebody else's tiny little mind well, there's something far bigger out there. There's a far better world. And with over 2,000 miles of canal, I'm so glad I'm out of here. Take care. Whoa, fancy camera angle. When did that turn into? Steven Spielberg. Well, it was bound to happen. Just stop, keep showing the top of your boat. Nice. No, just, you know, pan round a little bit. <laughs>
Fords, yeah, the constant cruisers will know what's coming next. But to the uninitiated, to you normies out there, and to you leisure boaters, let's see if you survive the next few minutes. Because for me, what I'm about to do is what narrow boating is all about. Cruising the cut, not speeding down the cut. So for the next five minutes, it's a test of patience. Will you survive the next five minutes or will you just X off now and go away? Not that I'm bothered because, you know, <laughs> clicks and views don't mean nothing to me. This is all fun for me. I, I enjoy doing this. And this particular manoeuvre in the Winding Hole is very challenging because the Winding Hole is very shallow. And I got stuck a few weeks ago. So this is kind of like a personal challenge to see if I can get it right the first time, every time. And you know what? You know, if you stick with me for the next five minutes, you might see something exciting. If you stick with me for the next five minutes, you might not find it exciting, but I think the liverboards and the um, constant cruisers will find it interesting and they will find it exciting. Or not. But you know what? I don't care. It's my video and I enjoy doing it. So, thanks very much. Uninitiated, leisure boaters and normies, you can leave now if you want. Take care and I'll see you in the next video. set off and then one as I'm jogging along but uh, I kind of missed the second one <laughs> but at least I've got the first officer looking after me no actually it's the captain so but yeah it's not going not going too bad to say it's shallow in this winding hole the initiated will know where I am but to the uninitiated it's just one big guessing game Yes, I have got one, but I don't like using it. I like the old tried and tested methods, do you know what I mean? But, you know, that being said, having a narrowboat is like having a caravan. They'll just about float anywhere if you let them. Um, but, uh, no, I've got one. Thanks for asking. <laughs> it's 
stir in the pot a bit. I was pivoting, as they say in the boating community. <laughs> when I'll be back. I'm moving down tomorrow to that river down the canal. <laughs> speed down the court and watch out for those mood hoovers yes the mood hoovers choose your friends carefully my friends well if you like what I'm doing here please consider subscribing to my channel and if you were to do this with your favorite youtuber if you were to do this with your favorite narrowboating channel i'm sure that they would appreciate it just as much as i do please hit the like and maybe even leave me a little comment i don't care if it's good i don't care if it's bad whatever suits you and if i think you're nice i might even respond to you take care and i will see you in my next video <laughs> mood hoovers mood hoovers where did you get that one from nige you know what don't let them suck you dry see ya <laughs>